How do you feel young artists should approach commercial music making if they want to experience just a teensy bit of success and longevity that you have enjoyed? Well, I had free reign when I was with the company, the record companies I was with. That's right. None of them told me what to do or how to do it or when to do it. Today, unfortunately for the young artist that comes up now, they got producers who tell them what to say, how to say it. When I listen to a lot of the stuff today, I hear so many of these kids they, they sound so much the same, you know. Yes. I mean, when, when I, you had identity when I was coming up. If, if, if Ella Fitzgerald opened her mouth and sang <laughs> one word, yes. you knew that was Ella Fitzgerald. That's right. You understand what I mean? Yes. You knew that was Nat Cole. You knew that that was Frank Sinatra. Or you knew that was Bob Strauss. They want you to come up with and sound like whoever had the last hit. Yes. That's what they want. As, as opposed to saying, hey, I'm creating my stuff. I'm going to do it the way I feel it. And, 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 and you worry about the selling of it there. But I would say to any young artist coming up, if you have faith in yourself, if you know what you're doing is good, and how do you know that? You can compare it with what you hear, what you hear that's out there. Yes. The, you know what I mean? And is it unique? Is it, does it have enough of its own say? If you believe in yourself, don't be discouraged. Don't let nobody discourage you. Keep, you know, keep on keeping on, as we yes. say. You know what I mean? Yes. Yeah, yeah, and don't, don't let somebody turn your, your, your you know. But you got to believe in yourself, you know. And above all, above all, practice. practice.